it's caught in the crossfire. It's caught in the Hello everyone, I am Sojit Kumar. Welcome to my channel. Today's the topic is about how to preserve an insect in resins. So today is a very interesting. So I have taken this insect from my balcony. The name of this insect is a dung beetle. I have kept for uh, one week uh, it have dead and I have kept it for one week uh, in uh, sun so that it will it is dried uh, properly now to preserve it uh, in uh, resins uh, first of all I will uh, give this insect uh, in a uh, resin for one minute to soak the resin properly after that we can proceed the next step to soak it I will take uh, this is the the container from where I will preserve and make this uh, set in this container I will mix the resin the epoxy resin In this, uh, I will give uh, one spoon of resins. It is also used in. It is also using also in uh, preserving the insect. First, I will s keep it for one minute for soak it. I will keep this uh, resin aside. Now I will use the hardener. It is very important so that without this, the resin cannot become hard. As I use uh, one spoon of resin, so I will give uh, approximately one spoon of uh, this hardener. One spoon of hardener. Let me keep it aside. Now I will mix it uh, for the uh, ten minutes. You should mix it for 10 minutes so that uh, the bubble cannot uh, create. So you can see I have stirred it uh, for uh, 10 minutes. You can stir it for 10 or 5 minutes. It is your choice, but uh, you must uh, stir it for more than 5 minutes. It will be better. Now, now take this container in this like this container it is very good if you take now take the insect inside the container it is only for soak purpose after soaking that we will use an another next container so that it is for it it is used as a base it is only for soaking purpose so that, that the resins can soak it properly the insect give a resist bath ok 
okay now mix it well so that uh, every corner each corner of the, that of this insect the resin can reach its appropriate place see I will doing it very well so that uh, the resin can reach every each corner of the insect hmm. now I will keep it aside uh, for the 10 minute and uh, giving the time for 10 minute For 10 minutes, I will keep it for for 10 minutes so that uh, the, it can soak the resins very well. At that time, I will we will make the main resin for it uh, preservation. It is for soaking purpose, so I will use only using only small amount of resin. Now I will we use uh, more. Now I will use uh, uh, two spoon of resins. This uh, one spoon. it is attached in a spoon so first remove this all so that you can get the appropriate measurement or quantity don't use more this one spoon mix I will use a uh, A second spoon completed. I have used only two spoon of the resin. Now I will clear the spoon. Now I will use the hardener. I have used the resin for uh, uh, two spoon. I have used now hardener. I will use uh, two spoon so that it can become hard in proper way. In a one spoon. Two spoon. This one only uh, small little uh, amount you can use. Only small little. Mm. Now it is completed. Uh. Now I will uh, stir it uh, for ten minutes. As the amount is small, so I will stir it for ten minutes. Do slowly. If you do slowly, then only you can uh, rescue from this uh, formation of uh, bubbles. Otherwise, the bubbles will be formed. So in this way, stir it for the 10 minutes. I have stirred it very well for 10 minutes. You can see, I have uh, stirred it for slowly. So that you can see the bubbles are not formed very much small 
small amount it can be from one or two teeth in this matter it is not so very tension you should take any tension so if you steer it slowly so you can get in this way now I have taken the next container same as I have used it for soaking purpose now I will transfer this uh, insect uh, dung beetle in this container first of all I will pour little amount of uh, this resin in the container small amount I will mix it very well in the walls then I will with the help of this uh, force I will take this in the insect I will transfer it in this container now slowly I will pour all the resins you can see slowly slowly you should pour it You have said look that the inside has come above the resin. You don't need to take tension slowly. If it is absorb all the resin, then it will go slowly down. Now it is uh, ten minutes. I soak it for ten minutes, but it will take more time. So you use more time for it uh, soaking purpose. Then it, uh, in this way, you will it will uh, sink inside the resin. Now, I will kept it for uh, mm. now. I will kept it for uh, seventy two hours. Should keep it for seventy two hours to proper uh, to become very hard. You, you can so take it for forty eight hours, for, but I will recommend you uh, keep it for seventy two hours so that. Uh, it will become hard very very properly so after 72 hour we will meet again so i will keep it for 70 hour, 72 hours so you can see this is after the 72 hours you should keep it 72 hours so this is the result fully hard now with the help of a blade or any sharp instrument you should cut the this uh, container you can see Slowly remove the plastic. You can see in this way. Now, one thing is like you clean the this container so that uh, you can uh, the visibility can be observed because uh, first of all, I should clean this as my container material is different as it is coffee mug so it is uh, not kind of like transparent but you can see small that uh, in this way you can uh, preserve your insect uh, in a resin 
but in in the uh, in upper in upper you can see the clear that is transparent the side it came because of my container i have i have used uh, this type of container but uh, yeah, don't make uh, this type of mistake uh, you all you take some plastic uh, container or plastic uh, container mug in this small container so you, you can get a transparent so it is absorb the this uh, my container this uh, surface material so it have taken uh, in this way taken the shape of this absorbed so in upper you can see it has uh, clearly you can see the beetle is uh, fully preserved the dung beetle is fully preserved so in this way you can preserve your favorite uh, insect uh, in a uh, resins and keep it uh, in in your collection box uh, or any kind of decoration you can make it so using the same procedure i have also preserved uh, this uh, insect uh, the, uh, the name of the insect is uh, rhino beetle i have uh, preserved uh, in uh, resins uh, that you can see the transparent it is fully transparent because the material i have used this plastic uh, this uh, plastic uh, material uh, plastic cup or you can uh, in this way so it is fully transparent okay this is a uh, one horn rhino i have preserved and uh, the plant i have preserved this uh, periwinkle uh, flower this uh, leaves with a small uh, bud you can see you can see a small bud this is a periwinkle flower and with the leaves so in this way you can preserve your favorite insect